Hello, welcome all again. Another episode with gaming with, uh, well, you can call me Magus Craig or Gideon, whatever you want to call me. Or as this character is, Jarvis Northoff. Alright, we're going to get some food. We're going to get fed up. Get our uh, eats up, our hunger good, taken care of, and then we're going to head out and do some uh, hunting, maybe. I like to do some hunting. Well, I'd like to find some wild animals and hunt them, so. Alright, we're going to look in here. Let's see here. That's it. We're going to make sure we take this the least quality. So let's open our inventory. We're going to take this out. And we're going to take... Let's take 30 with us. Because we might be gone a little while. We'll take 35. Alright. We're going to put that. I always put it down there. And these apples we will hold on to. In case we want to try and tame something. Alright. Now my tracking skill is not very high, but to prep here, if we tame them, we tame them. If we decide to kill them, we decide to kill them. So we will need these on. I'm going to take this off, and this off, and now I can recall home, which means that's good. We're going to just leave that all there. Now we should be set up very good for hunting. Now we're going to start with, uh, where is it, look for? Let's look for peaceful animals because obviously that's what we have to look for first to start off with. Okay. Uh, here, I'm going to get my system up so I can see that in the chat bar okay so I didn't see any tracks so we're gonna look for peaceful animals and we're gonna right click that so all I have to do is left click on the ground now this will go up every time I do this I could sit here and spam this if I wanted to but I would like to find some tracks and that didn't so we're gonna keep just going down the line and looking for tracks Nothing there. fail to find any tracks. I'm failing a lot to find tracks. Whether you fail or you succeed, you will gain skill. As you can see. And eventually, if you scan enough, even if you don't find tracks, you will find animals. Especially since I set this up at 100. Now, if I run into any aggressive animals, I'm going to hit the map button as quickly as possible. Uh, try to run away if I can, but I do not want to run them all the way to my house. Otherwise, they will camp right there at my house, and I will be pretty much out of luck. Okay, there we go. These look like some deer tracks. We're going to follow these. Which way are they going? Mm, not very far. Okay. Maybe they're going farther than I thought. I just gotta look for them. Okay. We might be on to a deer that we can kill and get some game meat. Some bones. 
as well as a hide, and I could definitely use the hide. <laughs> Now, if your tracks run out like that, hit your F3, make sure you're in the right square. I'm going to check right here. Excuse me. And I'm going to track again. And it should pick up more tracks. Sometimes it'll pick up different tracks, but then I hit F3 so I can see better. Uh, it looks like the tracks are ending right there not seeing them so last trajectory is this way right there they are again you can barely see them you can see them through oh maybe that's not it maybe that's it looks like it's it i'm gonna track this way and see yep right there right there they are okay it was it okay i was right just gotta look carefully and so right now we're this does look like it's a deer so if I'm tracking a deer, that's good. And I would suggest walking so you don't spook it or run up on it too fast. So just walk. Take your time with it. Okay, the tracks are still coming this way. And I would I would scan every once in a while where you're walking too, just to look. You don't want to spook it, and you if you spot it soon, sooner than later, because I've ran up on them before just following the tracks, and I've just like ran right into them and spooked them or almost spooked them, and you want to be cautious, and we're definitely picking these up. While you're out and about, you'll want to gather stuff like this. Ooh, I'm getting quite a few apples. This is a full up tree. What quality? 17. That's uh, that's pretty good for apples. All right, that's good. All right, we're gonna continue. We're following these tracks. All right, they're leaning right this way. We're gonna take a minute and kind of look. Right there it is. See? Oh no, that's a moose. Oh, we are not messing with that. That will kill us dead. A moose is nothing to mess with. If this is what I'm tracking, then I am not trying to fight it. And that's what I'm tracking. I just tracked the moose. Oh, look at him. He's looking at me. I'm not even going to it. He ran away. Okay, I, that's beautiful, though. I'm going to take a screenshot of that. All right, well, we're going to let him go. And we found something over here that looks interesting. It looks like some something. I'm not sure what it is, but I want to check it out. It looks like. Oh, it looks like a bunch of rock. Actually, this looks like marble or something. So we are going to we are going to inspect this. It is marble. Marble. I found marble. Look at that. Tracking a moose found marble. So we're going to locate this. Okay, this is right at the base of the mountain there. It's about due, due east from my place. We know where it's generally at, so we should be able to get back to it. Um, but for now, I am going to... I'm going to get my shovel out I'm going to get my shovel out well I don't want to stock up too much stuff on the ground we'll just note that this is here we'll remember that this is here I'm gonna write a little note on a piece of paper too uh, that way if I do not remember at least I have it Alright, let's see. Marble. 
10 quality. Do west, west, not east. Do west from, from home. Slight north. Or north, we will put north, west, west, northwest, north, northwest. No, northwest, west, ah, uh, yeah, northwest, west, we'll do that. All right, now we've got a note for it. This could come in very handy. There's that moose again. Look at him. He's a beaut, isn't he? I could try killing him, but he would rip me apart. I know he would. Moose are no faint thing to mess with. <laughs> Alright, let's track some more peaceful animals here. Alright, did we track anything? <laughs> I think we're tracking that moose again. That yeah, looks like moose tracks. Yeah, we're tracking that moose again. We're gonna run off here a little bit. Leave that moose to himself. Yes, boy, I hear you. You're being an antagonistic little turd. No, settle down. You're not going outside. It is raining. It is raining, Buford. You're not going outside. Now, if you want to test me, I will put you in your bed, and you can sit there. No. Don't do it. Mr. Mister, you're getting on my last nerve now. Go lay down. Go lay on the couch. Go lay on the couch. Looks like chickens. Chickens, maybe. Nope. That's that moose again, I think. And uh, I don't want that. Well, we'll check it out for a second, see what it does. Yeah, that's that moose. I don't want that. We're going to have to keep running here. It doesn't matter how far we go right now, because we can always recall the home. Or what this is. It's called Prayer to Home. Prayer to Homecoming, sorry. Not Recall the Home. Prayer to Homecoming. We're going to jog around here a little bit. Just kind of see. It's beautiful out, nice and sunny. Look at the clouds. Yeah, the tree, the flourishing nature. It's beautiful. Oh, look here. A patch of trees. And they are some big, big apple trees. Okay, this one doesn't look like it. Well, it has some fruit, so we're going to take that.
having a vantage point is a good thing. Okay, we can see pretty far out there. Not seeing too much. But I do know I have some things to do. Oh, I got injured. What did I get injured? How did I get injured? What's going on here? Boom. Five magnitude, so it's not very big, but it takes 30 minutes. I wonder how I got that. Hey, look, a clay pit. Well, since we're here and we were almost going to head back, we will grab up some clay. We may need this. So we're going to hit P. We're going to do this. And we'll put on a pickaxe. This is our used one, which does not have very much more use, and it'll be junk. And we are going to observe the quality of this. It's only 10, no big deal. So we're going to use shovel and lower. And we'll lower it. We'll just keep digging this. Ooh. I got 60 clay and then dirt fell in on me. if that dirt's going to cover up clay. Maybe I should, uh, hmm, let's get up here. Let's get up here and see what we can dig. Because this is clay right here. We're going to lower that, see what we get. I think we can get one more use. Nope, that's as much as we can get. Alright, now we're going to hit the 8. And bingo. I'm in my house where my bed is. And I have my clay that's making me run very, very slow. Okay, we're going to dump this clay off somewhere. And then we will call it good for now. This clay can be used to make whatever we need. We're gonna, uh, I don't know what this does. I'm going to look this up. Or, um... Sag. Okay, so I've never used that, so I'm not sure what it is. Mold. I could mold. Let's see here. I could mold clay tiles for a house, but then I'd have to kiln them and store them somewhere. Um, we're not going to do that just yet. I think what we're going to do with this is, actually, hmm. we'll use this later for some kind of some sort of uh, furnace or kiln situation. And that's all dropped. Now I know on this map I have clay right here. You can see it right there. So that's a little truck not very far. And that looks like that might be something too. That is the marble. That is the marble. That's the marble. So that's what marble looks like. It's that little kind of like light colored spot. So we know exactly where those are. So that is good. 
Alright, and that is gonna be it for the video, guys. Uh, I did another short video, so have a good one. Like, subscribe, comment, all that good jazz. Thank you.